Good evening. We're glad you're with us tonight. I'm Farron Foster. And I'm Paxton Boyd. Thank you so much for joining us. We begin with breaking news tonight. It was a catastrophe in Nashville for Solid Blue fans. The Kentucky Wildcats go one and done in the SEC tournament for the second straight year, losing to Texas A&M 97 to 87. The Cats have now won just two games in their last five SEC tournaments. And for that, we go straight to sports director Jeff Picoro and sports reporter Hallie DeVore live on the ground in Nashville with reaction to this loss. Guys, a really sad night for the Cats. Well, it really was, and Bridgestone Arena has become a house of horrors for this Kentucky basketball team. Two straight seasons, they bow out in their first game, and for the thousands of Kentucky fans that came down to watch and spend their money to get inside here and watch this team go home disappointed yet again. Kentucky gives up almost 100 points. Defense not there tonight, but they fell into a hole 8-1 to to start the game. Yeah, and the saddest part was the place literally looked like Rupp Arena. It was filled with blue. Texas A&M had like a high school size section, and they got the win. So definitely a really sad night for Kentucky fans. I feel like the next couple days are going to be a little shy of fans considering number one, Tennessee is out, and now number two, Kentucky is out as well. Yeah, if you're looking to go see some basketball and get a cheap ticket, <laughs> this is the place to come because you can sit pretty much anywhere tomorrow and Sunday for the championship game now. The one thing that Coach Cal said moving into this game was this tournament really doesn't matter. It's what happens next week, and we'll find out now Sunday night where the Cats are going. When we come back in sports a little bit later, we'll hear from the team and hear what they had to say about this stunning loss in their first game to Texas A&M. Guys, back to you.